gonna click right here at the bottom left corner of the screen this start button and then you're gonna type network proxy settings okay network proxy settings as you, and as you type it you should see this come up and then you want to click on that right here network proxy settings okay or you can also click the start button and then click on settings right here and then you're gonna click on network and internet and then you can click on proxy you know as long as it takes you to this screen right here you are good okay so now make sure once you go here make sure this option right here is off make sure this is off right here make sure this is off because for some reason you may be using a, a proxy all right so make sure that this is off so now what if okay you just done you just did that and still uh, this is not working for you well one thing you can do is you can reset your connections and to do that you're going to click the start button right here this no this time you're going to right click the start button right click with your mouse right click and then click on where it says command prompt right here command prompt with admin all right and so this should bring up the command prompt here it is and here you want you want to make sure you type this type net sh winsock reset type this to reset your connections okay so i'm going to do this and by the way i will have this command copied in, in the video description so you can copy and paste it into the command prompt to make things a bit easier for you so i'm going to and so right click and then here it is and paste it here it is net sh winsock reset and then press enter and it's going to reset my connections for me so now as you can see it says you must restart your computer in order to complete the reset okay so now after doing this this should really fix this your issue all right so now what if just whatever you do whatever you do is not working you tried you know you checked your modem you checked you did everything possible and it's just not fixing this these network settings for you well one thing you can do you can use your last resort you can do a factory reset okay you can do a factory reset and doing this is really simple to do that uh, simply click the start button right here the start button again and and type reset type reset and click on reset this PC right here so type reset and then click on reset this PC and then click on where it says get started right here and then you should see two options I keep my files or remove my files okay so if you want to keep your apps and settings you can choose to keep my files options if you want to remove everything you can choose to remove everything option okay so this is the last resort